Welcome back to the Kneecast Podcast. Well, we're celebrating 12 years without me having a fucking job. And it's also two, it's also New Coil Day. So they can't stop smiling. And we're gonna put... Um, a new coil of my vape. And I'm gonna actually clean inside of the glass too. Which I almost never remember to do. So it's gonna be very exciting. Hey Katie, hi 9026. It's new coil day. Now, I got Pally effect bad right now, so I have turned on the mobile data. I'm just getting all the rest of the juice out before I change the coil. This coil is pretty burnt. Okay, more, it's new coil day. Hi, everyone. Happy new coil day, everybody. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh, man. <clears throat> yep. Yeah. I should have just not. Everybody, me and Scotty Lyon just discovered that we, well, like, I shaved my head exactly four years ago, and he got a massive haircut exactly four years ago, so we're, like, freaked out. Hey, BBs. So what is that? Am I? Oh, sorry. <laughs> I didn't know that. Okay. Yeah, I, um, I, um, gib strangers. I, uh, Is that a Poland ball reference? Curious to ask you. Hi, Ron. And, um, just getting the rest of the juice out. Hey, Key. Right, yeah, so just vaping and vaping just to get all the juice. And then, uh, it's new coiling. I don't, um, right, so the latest TikTok, I put it in the stories because, um, the crop, it won't work with the cropping on Instagram, that's why it's not on Instagram, it's just in the stories. Oh, sorry, look, we, um, we have, we now have two Rons in the chat, guys. Vapes grease. <laughs> That's true. I never noticed that before. What the fuck? How did I not notice that? Vapes <laughs> <Babes> grease. <laughs> How the fuck did I not notice that? I did not. Oh man, it's good stuff. <clears throat> <laughs> just all these emojis going off. <laughs> Vaping that wax? What the fuck? Really? We vape wax? It's almost, we're almost ready to go here. I feel like I'm fucking dead too, actually. <laughs> we're not okay. That was, that was too funny. <laughs> How is everybody? Okay, so almost done. Everybody, uh, everybody just came in, you missed like the best joke and we're all just recovering, so. This is like quiet time in, in the live stream. Okay, I'm just gonna start changing it now. I guess we have to wait for it to cool off a sec. I asked you if the chicken nuggets were paleo and you didn't tell me, so I don't know. <sighs> yeah, 
Yeah, you can just ignore the second day at school too, Key. He doesn't fight. Like, nothing happens in the first few days of school. Like, you can just space out, dude. My day is going pretty great, actually. I'm hoping to pass out soon because it's been too good. Like, I just, it needs to be. So, after I change the coil, I'm probably just going to plug the vape back into charge and I'm hoping to fall, just pass out because it's been a really intense day, man. Like, it's been, it's been intense, dude. Okay, Brammer Hammer, well, our thing we've been using um is this I'm playing the theremin right now like literally right now okay fine there paleo okay fine i'll come in hi goats um so what's going uh go okay whoa 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 that was a while Okay, that was weird. Um, what happened there? Well, the thing we've been using to figure out if you're retarded and no one is telling you is um, a fair amount of water, Mikado. Uh, is if uh, if um, there's a stranger or someone from out of town or the Good Samaritan and they get paused at some point. Like, first they treat you like a human being. And then at some point it just stops. Like somebody's over at your house and you say something and then they get shushed and you don't. That shit is shit like that. You have to watch for what happens to the new person when they arrive in this situation before and after they get paused into not thinking that you're a human being. That's how we know that you're retarded. No one is telling you. Well, yeah, well, it's kind of what loaded, what the backlash or something. I don't know. I've had a really, I've had a really intense day. I think I might be crashing. Hey, Joel. How 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 is the design? Or I guess he'll send it to me when it's finished. I'm I'm really really looking forward to it. Really looking forward to it. Can't wait. What loaded? What are you guys talking about? Oh, there are a lot of you here. I think, uh, I don't know either. Salami or sausage? Um, sausage. Um, yes, Emmons, that's what that means. It's really sad, but it is the case here. Yeah, it was gonna be totally rad. I think those ones are gonna are gonna be really popular. Thoughts on Smashy Pumpkins? I don't remember actually. It's been a while. I mean, I remember that from like grade seven or something. Okay, so here's the old coil. We did have to use it for a while because they were out of the. Wow. Yeah, that is burnt AF. It's bad, guy. Oh, you can't see shit because it's full screen, but it's burnt. That is wow. How long are they using this thing for? Jesus Christ, dude, that is really bad. Actually, I'm like doing it myself. Okay, let's let's clean the inside of the uh of the glass. Yeah, ninety twenty six. I've been through this a few times. There's a video up on YouTube of what happened to me at Tom Segura's show. Like meeting him after was totally cool. It's just totally fine. I don't know, Brammer Hammer. Maybe I don't know. I don't know what they're doing. He was wholesome and fatherly, yeah. Dad-like, as it were. No, he wasn't a father. He was a dad. No. That type. He was like the Yondu of that shit. So yeah, my YouTube just has the same name as my IG and my TikTok. It's easy to find. And now, it's easy to find, dude. Just apes grease. And there's, it's also, it's up in my link tree on my bio, too. You can just click through real fast.
Yeah, I, I, I did watch the new one with Dr. Drew. I didn't, I was, it left me disturbed and I don't want to talk about it. Oh, there's a band called Hail the Sun. Okay, cool. I'll take a look at it. Thank you for letting me know. Did not know that. Almost done cleaning the glass here. I want to get it good and clean because as it, a lot of the times I forget to do this part, so that's to be nice. I'm out of Q-tips. I'm out of Q-tips. I never thought I'd run out of Q-tips. Once I had a, so many Q-tips that I was sure they would never run out. And now I am out. And one day I'm going to make the video explaining the name, guys, but the science isn't finished. Okay. No, I don't. I don't live anywhere near a first-run theater, Mikado. So no, I don't see new movies that are in theaters. Unless if it's important enough that I have to see the camera before getting spoilers. But I will probably watch it. It's like I'll probably watch this new Shining movie. Yeah, well, that's the thing. The thing is, holy hand grenades. Apparently, this episode of the podcast was recorded before I actually met him. So I've been told on Reddit. So I wasn't told by anyone else. And uh, so that was a roller coaster. It was a roller coaster. It was, it was horrible. It was very hard on me. Let me tell you, I, I, I had a terrible fucking day yesterday. I'm having a great day today. So let's just forget it, can't, can't we, please? Because that it was, it was way too hard on me. Because it was just so weird. I don't know how much cash they're making off me, but I'm not seeing any of it. I mean... Tom Segura did drop about 300 bucks on me, but it, that was like three weeks ago, so I don't have it anymore. I spent it on food. He did. He dropped stacks. He gave me 200 bucks Canadian and 300 bucks American, so it's probably about, I don't know how much more that is. Not, not much. I think I got the quail good and tight. I guess we'll find out. Uh, holy hand grenades. Here's the thing. I, I feel strongly that something there's something going on there that I still don't understand. So actually, okay, when I met Tom Segura, he, um, oh fuck, I just put that up. He he really there was something off about him, like very off. Like, like he was like it. Now I realize what it was. It was guilt. I know it's nothing. And I would like a new computer, but what the fuck am I supposed to do? But I don't have control over the financial aspect of this situation. But there's no, there's no, there was no beef. They just aired the podcast out of order and it looks like there is. Nothing, like, it, it, nothing actually changed. Except from the perspective of those audience members who don't know that the podcasts are apparently recorded, like, at least three weeks in advance. I had no fucking clue. The last time of what I don't think I had anyone has any control over that holy hand grenades. I I just whatever it's just I'm just gonna ride the wave, okay? I, I can't get too emotional over this. And that was I will say that was really hard on me. I mean, I just had to go back to the things. I just I really had to go back to the things that logic dictates, you know, and just stay the hell away from pathos for at least twelve hours. You know, I can do that now. I do it all the time. Something I'm ridiculously good at, actually. Um, what do you think? <clears throat> yeah, Diego. I don't. I don't even know how far in advance. I honestly don't know. It's. Well, we can say that we can surmise that it was at least three weeks, possibly longer. Uh. MW Falcon, I miss the comfort in being sad. Re re record the intros before they release. Yeah, I know. Like I don't know how this shit works. I'm actually kind of surprised it's not recorded. But like, don't they have like an emergency stop button that says um uh some like what what if what if they record a joke about some world event and then 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 a disaster happens? Like, wouldn't they have some stop button that says no, we're not releasing this, or they can just cut out the parts where where are they shit on me or whatever like because it's hard because it, it, it's again the timeline is disturbed and people it looks like they changed their opinion on me but it's basically just uh just too old to matter
but that's just so yeah it's not it's just really not ideal uh I don't think I might have much of a choice there holding hand grenades. I just no, but it's the vast majority of my audience now is their fans. I can't. There's nothing I can do about it. I'm just trying not to give a fuck because I I know the reality of the situation and that it was pre-recorded. I'm just trying not to care. Like, because I know that's not how he felt after he met me, and like, but that made no sense until I found out that it was that far pre-recorded. And I was like, okay, like somebody told me on Reddit was nice enough to like post that it was a top comment in the uh in the subreddit uh thread about the podcast episode and that was just like oh okay but like before that I, I was not dealing with it like it was fucking weird and um uh so i know it's just been a roller coaster and today today I, i'm clearly fine yeah, today i was making art again honestly by kind of by accident and that means i'm fine so that's all no i'm just gonna it's just that it's over basically i dealt with it that fast so here we go and i'm refocusing on on certain things like um uh, i'm getting i just ordered a better kind of zinc than i have so I'm refocusing on zinc supremacy we're having a new t-shirt probably maybe even later today and then after that we're going to make the zinc supremacy t-shirt and uh joel you're still here after you've done that one, we can do one more. We'll do Zinc Supremacy. I'm not sure what how I want to do it. You guys just want plain Zinc Supremacy symbol, or do you want text that says maybe like more Zinc, less problems? I was thinking. Or, I mean, I feel like you might also just want plain, but then I don't want you to get tagged, so. 